Uh, no, I, I'd put that under the marketing bracket, right? So marketing is what you do to draw people to you. You want to attract people to you. That's the whole purpose of marketing. Selling is what you do once they get in front of you. So you can have all these fancy funnels, nurturing and doing all that. That's all good, but that's all marketing. It's not until you actually have to talk to them that a selling skill kicks in. This is what's important. An expression of interest is not a buying signal. Yeah, just because someone says they're interested in what you have, that is not a buying signal. It's intellectual curiosity, maybe at the best. Yeah, someone says, I'm really interested in what you do. That means nothing. What I need to figure out is, do you actually have problems that this thing fixes? You've got to first acknowledge you have problems that this fix. Secondly, you've got to accept you have those problems. So it's not enough to say, well, I've got them. You know, it's like an alcoholic says, I've got a drink problem. Do you accept you're an alcoholic? No. Oh, well, this, this course ain't really going to help you then, right? So you've got to acknowledge you've got a problem, you've got to accept you've got a problem, and then you've got to be able to convince the salesperson you want to fix it. You see, if a prospect can't convince me they want to fix their problem, are they ever going to spend any money on it? No. So if they can't convince me they want to fix a problem, so everything I do is designed to get the prospect to convince me that they need sales training. Because anyway, oh, I'm really interested in sales training. Why? Well, I want to be better. Why? Oh, I want to make more money. Well, why can't you make more money now? Uh, well, because I'm not good at selling. No, that's not an answer. I'm not good at selling. Why aren't you good at selling? What are you not doing that's not working? Uh, I don't know. Ah, right, now that's better. So this is where you need me. I need to help you figure out what you're doing. And then, so this is my job, is to get them to realize, to discover that they need what I have, and then they buy from me. So you've got, there's marketing, there's prospecting, and there's selling. Marketing is drawing people to you. Prospecting is a form of marketing, except you're going out cold and literally engaging with someone and trying to draw them into you. But a prospecting call isn't a sales call. All I want to do on a prospecting call is find out is there enough reason for us to continue a conversation because it sounds like you have symptoms of a problem we could fix, but we don't know yet. That's what the sales meeting is going to be for. So I, 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 I categorize these things very clearly because everyone loves to confuse them and roll them into one. And I don't think that's and that's why salespeople are semi-marketers and semi-prospectors. They're, they're merging different behaviors and skill sets.